Imagine you've never seen so many books in one place. Oh yeah, I imagine. Pretty incredible, isn't it? We've gathered all of Hyrule's known literature on ancient civilizations here. As for the actual number of books, well... Um... Is that... is that thing on your waist? Is, is that a, a Sheikah? Oh, there's no mistaking it. That's a real Sheikah slate, isn't it? I've never actually seen one in person. But if you could just show me the runes on it, I, I'd be most appreciative. Oh, I guess he's trying to say about it, yeah. Or he's just like thrusting a little bit here and there, and that's how he shows off his Sheikah slate. Because it's on his, his waist, you know. It's the only way to show off anything that you have attached to your waist. Because that's what uh, Jedi do with their lightsabers. <laughs> what? Stasis, ah, Magnesis, ah, yes, yes. The remote bomb and Cryonis, uh, what else? Let's see. Uh, so that's it for runes, but, hmm, I see you're not actually having your amiibo rune on. You're doing it wrong, sir. Strange. Oh. Doesn't seem like you have the basic runes. I understand it, why we're- why they're missing. Or I don't understand why they're missing. There must be some reason. Ah, oh, where are my manners? I nearly forgot to introduce myself. My name is Simon. Ah, oh, yeah, that would- that makes sense. It's just Simon with a Y, you know? You- you are Link, right? You know my name? Uh, Lady Impa uh, got me up to speed. You see, we- we told a young man holding a Shuka slate will appear, and you must do all you can to help him. He'll be... Uh, a hope that awakens from the slumber of restoration. His name will be Link. Oh dear, I- I guess I forgot to tell you something very important. But my voice changes every five seconds, it's really weird. It's very slightly the same, but it's not at the same time. Listen, Ms. Director, this is the real Sheikah Slate. Ah. Oh, that's right. I, I haven't introduced our director. Ah. Miss Para happens to be right over there. Pura? Let's go, let's go with Pura, because it sounds... Or well, actually, Pura would probably make more sense, but I, I maybe would want to say Pura just because of the fact it sounds funny. <laughs> As the Hatano Air Ancient... Tech Lab Director, Miss Para is the world's foremost authority on ancient Hyrule culture. So my accent changes every single second. What the heck? This person must be a Sheikah as well, because... Or maybe they're all Sheikah. Everybody in this entire region is Sheikah because of the fact that they all have gray hair. And even if they're children, they still have gray hair. Because I don't want to say that she's she's a child or something. Maybe I should do a voice for her too. I'm just gonna throw everything out the window and not do non not 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 do voices now. Check it. Yeah, I have the utmost respect for Miss Pura, and she's accomplished all she's accomplished. She's a very accomplished person. I'm honored to be her assistant. Oh, on that low note, Link, you see, the director may look like a young girl, but well. <sighs> Maybe it's not a place to be telling you these things, that she's actually a werewolf in disguise. You should talk to Miss Pura herself. That's why she's called Miss Pura, because she wants to distract from the fact that she's a werewolf, so she sounds like she has a, a cat kind of name. Yeah. But his voice was almost... It was going to be like one thing, but then it was going to be another, and then I just couldn't decide, so I just kind of did something weird. Oh no. But, Pura, we have to have the epic stare down first and foremost. I have a hoe on my back and you are a hoe. Let's talk. <laughs> I'm sorry I insulted you before I even talked to you. I must talk first, then insult later. Uh, hey, hey, hey! Are you surprised? The director of this laboratory is not Simon, it's me! Snippity snap! <laughs> anyway, Linky! Do you remember my any dreams of the time in the slumber of restoration? You don't look like you changed a bit in the past 100 years, but something must have happened in that time. Ah, oh, well, no matter. I'm just happy you're still in one piece. 
Well, relatively speaking. Blinky! Maybe she just really likes Slinkies, too. That's why she's calling him that. What's with that look? You still don't remember me, right? I really shouldn't be using this voice for her, because this is uh, the classic Zelda voice that I use in every single thing, but... Still, she's a little girl, and she seems important enough that has to be having a voice. Um, hmm, I don't remember, because if I put a remember, I'm, she might actually skip over it. So I have no idea who she is. See, look, at, you can hear that sound. It, she, she sounds like, oh no, my computer's freaking out on me. Remind me later. Screw you, Windows 10. Really? I am so shocked! I don't know if I'll be able to, I'll be able to recover from this. That's why I'm stumbling over my words! Even though a hundred years ago I took you to the Shrine of Resurrection after Calamity Ganon fatally wounded you! Even though I was one... I was the one who put you safely into the Slumber of Restoration! Despite all that, you still don't remember me? I don't remember. Hmm, as I expected. After a hundred years in the Slumber of Restoration... Subject has lost all memories. Noted. Oh, sorry, I had a, a bad habit of taking notes rather abruptly like that. It's a charming quirk, isn't it? Same with my voice, it's charming and quirky. It doesn't hurt to listen to. <laughs> or more importantly, actually, to do, it probably would hurt more to. Anyway. Uh, Anywho, do you have any questions for me? Aren't you a child? Well, that wouldn't be the first question I have for you, but, uh, sure. How very rude! Hmm, or perhaps it's not rude at all. I suppose that's actually a rather logical conclusion to jump to. The truth is, I look this way because of a failed experiment. Oh, that's how she's a hundred years old. Cause there's, maybe she's Benjamin Button. Yeah. Well, I say failed, but in some ways, it's actually a success. I documented the full affair in my diary upstairs. But the whole experiment is embarrassing. Uh, well, that sounds like a kind of experiment that I like to get into. I don't know. There's probably going to be an endu I know somewhere in here. So I insist you refrain from reading it. Anyway, enough about that. Uh, back to the topic at hand. Here you are, after a hundred years! Here to defeat Calamity Ganon, who is growing in strength with every passing moment. So that's probably why she doesn't want me to read her journal, but I'll do it anyway. And to rescue our beloved Princess Zelda. That is, if you've got the courage to try. And to help the one true hero, I, the uh, one and only Pura, Pur Pura, as I like to say, so silly. We'll restore the basic functions missing from the Sheikah Slate. And what do you say to that? Uh, once more? <laughs> that should be the first option, so then this goes into the owl from Ocar of Time. Yes, please. <laughs> I knew you'd say that. All right then, first I need you to run an errand for me. Uh, okay. Better be a good one. Uh, what's with that look on your face? I think that's just how he always... Actually, he looks kind of happy right now. His, uh... I don't know if he usually has his teeth showing like that, or if that's actually... I think that's actually his lips. I don't know. He's just, uh, doing some crazy faces at you. Nope, those are definitely his teeth. <laughs> they had to model them. It was very important in the game. You don't think I'd fix your Sheikah Slate for free, did you? Uh, I did not. Hmm, you're pretty considerate for a young person. But then, I suppose that's because you're actually over a hundred years old. Let me explain for the, what this errand entails. You know the unit furnace? On that furnace, on the wall just outside this laboratory. Could you please bring the blue flame from the agent furnace in town? And, uh, can you use it to light our furnace? This sweet little, uh, garden stone will start... Once you do that, uh, we're, start working. Uh, allow us to restore your missing runes. Huh, I wonder if that young woman, young, young woman these days, still say the things like sweet and little. Uh, 
Ah, oh, well, I suppose it isn't the matter anyway. Oh. Okay then, I'm counting on you to get the blue flame! Holy crap, I've been, I'm, I'm mixing voices together just all day today. And this is why I didn't plan on doing very many voices in this game. But it, it is kind of a thing that happens now. So, blue flame, uh, middle of the park here. Let's play this uh, tune and get going. Do I actually, no, that's, that wouldn't make any sense. I've been having this ocarina of time in my pocket this entire time. After these 10,000 years or whatever since anything actually happened, ever. Okay, well... Do I actually have a quest marker? I should actually check that first and foremost. Because if I have a quest marker, that will help me a little bit. But I don't know... Actually, wait, what's what's this one? That's, that's just like my... Oh, locked memories! Okay. Yeah. Cool, cool. Uh... So I guess that that is the... Carry the blue flame from the ancient furnace. Is the ancient furnace really... That... Okay. And also I said locked memories instead of mementos, but... Eh, you know, it happens. It's not really close to the village, though. That's the weird thing. Also... That just happens to be where I'm headed anyway. So it is kind of in the village. Okay. It's strange the way things work, because, uh, yeah, I wanted to go there anyway, and I'm completely lost, I'm confused, and I want to touch those birds down there. Oh boy, there's so many goats. Is this a bull? Hey, you. I want to ride you. It's actually a cow, not a bull, but I just assume that whenever you have horns, it has... It has to try to murder because of the fact that, you know, it always happens. People are safe with cows. They make sure that the horns are nicely trimmed. Although that actually is kind of uh, safety safety nets on the horns. Okay, well. This entire area is kind of uh, confusing, I find, though. Because it looks like this shouldn't be part of the village, but it really is. Hey, hello. I wonder if that's part of the update, because there was an update to this game right before playing, as there's like every single time I play. <laughs> it seems like. There's just always updates, updates, updates. Oh, this seems to be rather easy to get. Oh, that's probably why there was a torch in there. Yeah, that would make sense. So then if I just go like this... Actually, I wonder... What will this- oh, yes, it does work. Oh. Rain. You got me again. Oh, boy. That was a mistake. If anybody got hit by that flame, uh, well, they had it coming for one. For two, it was partially a mistake, but partially not. So there should be a- oh, that's where it is. I have you now. Because, uh, yeah, I was just on the wrong spot. I will come back to that flame later, then. I kind of want to burn down, like, all their crops, though, just because. What happens if you burn down their crops with the blue flame of, like, legend and sadness and whatnot? Will it make the crops better? Because <laughs> it's kind of like uh, the forest fires that people light on purpose. I'm just going to be lighting... Uh, grass fire on purpose, because it will make the grass grow back stronger and better than before. Or supposedly something like that. Ooh! Lizard? Oh, It's not like it really matters so much. Because I don't really care about lizards so much, I don't think, as much as... Pots. You! Did you appreciate that pot? I don't think... Well, those people just like to be singing. They're very happy in the... Hat... Hat... No. Hatino? Well, there's... In... I want to know... Yeah, Hat... No. I'm going to pronounce it like that, still. Until they actually have voice acting from uh, Zelda herself, we're not going to be able to know exactly how to pronounce any of these things. But... Wait, I already did the shrine. That shows my memories. It's just like in the game. 
You gotta be kidding me. Because I just... I, I know everything but nothing at the same time. So that's why instead I will go up here and throw pots off the roof. Ooh! Yeah, that's just a rusty shield. <laughs> Makes this even more dangerous and more exciting. Oh well. Back to the blue flame then. Oh boy. I'm just gonna have to burn everything to the ground. Cause I'm very upset that I'm just not remembering what I want to do today. Oh well, it's... This is going to be comparable, I want to say, to whenever I start playing Doom again. Which, Doom is now over, if you haven't really realized. Uh, if you haven't watched that series, uh, go watch it. Maybe not. <laughs> Pause this video right now and then go watch those, uh, all the Doom videos. But, uh... I wonder... Oh yeah, that also... Ow, oh, boy. That almost hurt me. But, uh, yeah, I, I always start kind of slowly. So can I actually- I don't think I can actually run with this thing. But... You know what they say about the blue flame of legend? It must burn. Okay, I guess that the blue flame of legend doesn't actually- Oh no, it does cause forest fires. Only you can cause forest fires. Cause that's what- Oh yes. Look at that updraft. Well, I find that maybe this uh, flame might actually take longer to burn things, so I don't know why they would want this. We have this special kind of flame. It's blue, and it's not very effective at doing much of anything whatsoever. Can you give it to us? It's... Ooh, that looks like a quest. I'm going to have to come back. Gotta remember, uh, which I probably won't. Okay, I'm not really on the main path. But the main path over there looked like I thought it was going to go inside the river. I want some new clothes. Oh, no way! It's her? Maybe that she's just a traveling person that follows me around because she just thinks that Link is just so sexy. Oh, no, I did it again. Uh, well, sort of, but not entirely. But she thinks that Link is just such a sexy person with his uh, infinite amount of... ...nakedness. You can have an infinite amount of nakedness. Stop following me. You will burn. You will burn. There we go. Because <laughs> when you see somebody carrying the Olympic torch, you just don't go running up to them like that. That's not right. I'm just going to cook this apple. For good luck. That's what, another thing you do with the Olympic torch. Uh oh. I think I probably should run. Because the weather might be a change in again. And I can't be the best Olympic sprinter, swimmer, and maybe even uh, still torch carrier, of course. If I uh, am getting rain all over it. Oh no. But that's essentially what this is, I think. It's that they didn't really want the flames as much as they wanted to have a new ceremony. It's going to be carried down through the generations of the people here at Hatno Village. Don't you even dare. <laughs> I will burn you! I will burn you! Oh yeah, that's a pretty good angle of the Olympic relay here. It's a pretty good uh, view of the Olympic relay. For some reason, when you are talking about the Olympic training regime of the sprinters, going with the flame. You have to be pretending it is golf. Or is that golf? I want to say it's golf. Whenever All the golf commentators sound like that. So... Yeah. Anyway. I'm almost here, guys! Oh, boy! I'm gonna light this entire house on fire. But she said outside, right? Hey! That is kind of interesting. I think that this will probably happen again at a different point in the game, that you just have to... The blue is essentially their technology fire. But yeah, it's now a travel gate. And I can use this to get more fire to burn things down. But I will... I don't think you can burn down trees exactly. You can definitely burn down grass. 
Which I will just set things ablaze and then when they come out here, they're just like, oh yeah, good work. Oh no! Oh, I can't bring flame in here. That's probably... Oh yeah, it is definitely technology fire, because then it will start dripping the knowledge into my uh, eyes, because they're very dry right now. Hello, Pura. Purr, purr, purr. It seems that most of your wounds healed during the slumber of restoration. Anyway... Linky, thank you so much. Now then, uh, take a look over there. The Guidance Stone must be starting to react. There's nothing mysterious about it. Just, this is the pure science. <laughs> hey, my sweet little Guidance Stone. You sure know how to make this old researcher's heart flutter. Well then, uh, let's go ahead and restore those Sheikah Slate ruins for you. Give me a nice snap. Go on. No time to be shy about it. I, I guess that she's a very big fan of Nintendo Switch, because, you know, they always have to do the snap whenever they're <laughs> doing things. Uh, yeah, snap! <laughs> nice one! Uh, hokey, then, uh, Chica Slate Repair underway! Kind of stone lock removed! Wow. Now, let's do this thing! No, oh, please, put your clothes back on. The blackness, it's engulfing me! So that's what happens the lights turned off and well I was already naked to begin with like I always am she gets slate authenticized or th I thought authenticated <laughs> yes yeah, so I'm making new words camera high rule compendium and album missing files confirmed okay I don't know if I really want a camera so much but oh well I can pretend this is Wind Waker and do that thing uh, starting repair Seriously though, I wonder how, like, this knowledge kind of thing would actually taste. Oh, see, there is another one that I thought that I was missing before. It's not just that amiibo. Uh, instantly render a visible image into a picture. Okay. That's probably a good idea. Oh, look at that! Oh, I have a feeling I know what this is. Hyrule Compa- oh no. I don't know what that is, but I don't really want to know. Because that 24 of anything is quite a bit. Repair complete! I don't know why I was partially going to do th her voice, but then... Oh, boy. It's a weird day, okay? <laughs> and it's done! So, it, it's all fixed up now. Uh, let's see here, which one is it? Camera? Hyrule Compendium? Album? Yep, it looks all good. I love that that's like the one feature that was missing that uh, is very important to the rest of my journeys. Oh yeah, you need a camera. Just just in case, you sure you need a camera. It's not going to help you through uh, runes, tr rune trials or anything like that and the rest of all the shrines, but uh, camera. So I know this is sudden, but hear me out. I want you to take pictures of me, all sexy like and sell them on the black market. I don't know, there, it was, that was going somewhere. Take a picture of me with the... Oh, it is actually take a picture of her. Oh, and don't forget to let me see it. Oh, boy. Well, uh, let's... Can I go into... No, let's, let's do this. <laughs> this is amazing. I'll put her in the background. There we go. Uh, can I zoom in? You actually do it like that. I don't know. Oh, download complete arms. Oh, what what what's that about? There we go. <laughs> oh, uh, okay. Cool, good to know. But did she not like that? I just took a picture of you. Hmm, my seer scars were- Okay, I guess that she's just saying. Yes, I took one, look at this. Oh, I can't wait to see it. Let me see, let me see. 
Which one is it? <laughs> you know, that's not a very good effort now, is it? I thought it was a pretty good effort. I got the most important thing in frame, mostly, which is uh, me. And my rusty shield, I guess, apparently. Uh, why don't you take a picture? You must be sure to center the subject. Got it? Okay, then, uh, we'll have to start over. Okay, fine. Let's, let's zoom in. Should do this. But no, I guess, uh... That's probably good, because I think she wants a full body shot. Because she's short and stuff. And... There you go. Oh, I guess that that's... Mm, I probably could have went closer of a zoom then. Whatever. Safe. Are you happy with that? <laughs> okay. Here you go. Uh, did, you, did you want the picture? I took one. Did you get a good one this time? I think it was pretty good. Huh? Hmm, who is this beautiful young creature? Uh, I, I guess that's my cue. Sorry, I kind of lost it. Uh, it wasn't on purpose. Hmm. Well, it's not just a pretty girl in these images. Yes, there are some old landscape photos stored in the album. I know Princess Zelda made frequent use of the camera feature, but this... Hey, Linky, it... It dawns on me that you were Princess Zelda's appointed knight, which means... It's a strong possibility that you accompanied her on all these places where she's... These pictures were taken. Oh, right. The lost memory thing. Uh, that could prove troublesome. But don't lose hope. Uh, it just means that these pictures could be a missing piece to restoring your lost memories. So why do I need to restore my lost memories? There might be memories I don't want to restore. There's a reason why Wolverine sometimes loses his memories. Some of them are important to lose. Some of them aren't. You know... Whatever. If my hunch is correct, I suggest you turn to check in with Impa. She knows more about Princess Zelda than even I do. Ah. Oh yeah, there's just one more thing I need from you. You don't have to worry about this until after you see Impa, but I want you to bring me back some ancient materials. Bring them to me, Robbie, or or at the the, the archaeological tech lab. Ancient tech lab. Is it, that isn't what this is, then? I guess not. As if my joy wasn't enough, you must... If you bring us ancient materials, we'll give you something good as a reward. Alright, let's do this. Okay. I... Oh yeah, we'll see. It is in this reach. Hmm. Who's Robbie, though? Uh, by oh, proceeding to the Akala Ancient uh, Tech Lab, so I have no idea where that is. It's a different tech lab somewhere in the world. Oh well, slated for upgrades. Side quest. Okay, what what is? Do I? Where's my other? Oh, these are all side quests, not main quests. I get it. Man, I think I have a lot of side quests in, in a way. Uh, saying so for some ancient things. So. Huh. I guess that I, for both, like there's two different ones. Oh, you have to ask her for answers. Okay. So I guess that that is uh, helpful. I'm going to ask her right now well, before I leave. Uh, okay. Something on the mind? Uh, who is Robbie? <laughs> Please, is it a robot? Robbie is my subordinate! Now there I said it! I think he's still on the edge of Akala researching guardians. I haven't seen him for a hundred years, so, uh, so who knows? Anything else? Oh, something good. Aha! I'm glad you asked! If you bring some ancient materials, I'll power up your runes! You'll need three ancient screws to power up your Sheikah sensor. You need three ancient shafts to power up your remote bombs. And you'll need three ancient cores to power up stasis. 
And now we're on the same page. We can you can stop staring at me. Uh, hurry up and bring some ancient materials. Okay. I completed a side quest. Oh boy. Uh Wait. No, maybe I didn't. Oh, maybe that just tells you. Uh, if you provide these ancient materials, uh, yeah. It's really weird the way that side quests work, because I, I want that to be off there, because I'm a little bit OCD with uh, various things. In this in particular, I want this quest off my hotbar. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, well, I guess if you want me to keep it on there, I will. But I will uh, go back to Impa, because I don't know where that other research lab is. I really want to go inside there, but I will uh, check up here. This ladder appears to go nowhere. Interesting. It was a trap all along. <laughs> She's just looking at me like, oh, man, Link is just such an idiot. Okay, I can open this door. That leads to the outside world. Okay. Oh, a sunshroom. A bright red mushroom that grows in hot climates. Imbued with the power of heat, they can be used to cook dishes that will allow you to endure the bitter cold. Oh. That might actually be a higher level of uh, protection against cold than what I currently have. Because my current cold protection is... Uh, low level, but that might be high level. The bridge, in particular. Yeah, I don't know, but all I know is I'm gonna have to sneeze in like a minute here. Oh boy. It's just the worst thing, is that when you know you're gonna have to sneeze, but then you don't want to. So you may be thinking, why am I... Why are you climbing up this uh, thing here, Kano? I had to change the pronouns and whatnot, but... Uh, come on, let go. Uh, there you go. Well, I want to actually uh, read her journal, first and foremost. I wonder if it's at the very, very top, or if it's, like, in the medium top. It's probably very, very top here. Because this looks very special. But I love that she said that it was written and documented in her journal. Like, oh, it's so embarrassing. And then, uh, yeah, she's just like, oh yeah, don't, don't read it, though. Now, I just need to know. Uh, research diary for anti-aging rune. Classified, for pure as eyes only. Uh, I'll read the last page. Anti-aging experimental trial, day seven. This, morning ex this morning's exam results indicated that I am still age six. Same as yesterday, perhaps my age reversal has stopped. As luck would have it, today I've also finished developing the beta version of an age-boosting rune. If successful, this should be able to reverse the effects of anti-aging rune, and I hope it will anyway. All I need to do is increase the output and expose myself to its rays. However, when I tried to add this feature to the Sheikah Slate I made, I found that the Guidance Stone had stopped. Uh, what's more, the blue flame in the furnace has gone outside. Gone out. Uh, gone out outside. I sent Simon to the ancient furnace, but he was too clumsy and it was, it was raining and nothing went to plan. So I had to go down there to help. But a girl in the village saw me and what a mess I've made. Not only am I able, unable to continue my research in this state, I can only work by the light of gas lamps. What to do? Okay, it's good to know. I don't know why it says previous page, so are there only two pages in this? Because I read last page, but then previous page would have been like the page before... Oh, boy. I don't know. That's not that's not embarrassing in the slightest. Unless she... Uh, it was embarrassing for the first page, and I just didn't read that. I just read the second one. So I'd like to get to the, the nitty-gritty bits and the ending. Oh, I want to look at this. Can I use telescope? Nah, guess not. <laughs> 